Hey, what's up? This is Dan here with a quick tip for any Chrome users out there. So if you're like me and you use Google's Chrome browser, you may find from time to time that you might get a large buildup of open tabs across the top of your screen. Some websites we might want to keep open for later, some we might be working with right now, and others we're just not sure what to do with yet. One tab is a free extension for Chrome that collapses all your open tabs into, ironically, one tab, a list of your open websites, saving on clutter, and most importantly, saving on computer memory. The download link is below. Let's go take a quick look at one tab. So here we are on OneTab.com, as I said this link is in the description, you can download OneTab from this website, add OneTab now, just click that and it'll install it in Chrome. Remember it only works in Chrome though. So as you see here it says on the headline, save up to 95% of memory and reduce tab clutter in Google Chrome. As you can see I have a few websites open up the top here, Wikipedia, BBC, CNET, YouTube, Amazon, Steam, GameSpot, Xbox, Netflix, whatever. Uh, we have a few different websites and as you can see they have an example here too of what it can look like. Uh, before there was 1981 megabytes used, 95% reduction in memory and that can be handy. You can read the rest of this here if you want to find out more about uh, one tab. So it's going to give you guys a quick example here. I've already installed this extension and I have loads of tabs open. Here's the extension button up here. It's a little blue funnel. So if I click this, all my tabs disappear into one tab with all my websites listed in a handy list. As you can see, 14 tabs. I can restore them all, delete them all, or share this whole thing as a web page to someone I want to send it to. So I'm able to send all these web pages to a friend. That's a handy link too. So all these here are all the websites in the list. I can delete them individually or delete them all. If I click one of them, it opens up that web page, deletes it from the list into a new tab. Go back in here again. If I press and hold Control or Command on a Mac, I can open up the website without removing it from the list or I can remove websites individually by just clicking this X here. So I have two more tabs open here. If I click the button again to reduce the tabs, it'll create a new section here with two new tabs uh, with those two there. So I can have different sections in here. You can create new web pages and share them all. There's a few more options up the top here. So restore all will open a brand new window as you can see with all my tabs open again in a new window. And I can just click the button again, reduce them all down into another tab. So very handy, very simple, and that is one tab. Hey, what's up? This is Dan here with a quick tip for any Chrome users out there. Users. I can't say users. Hey, what's up? This is Dan here with a quick tip for any Chrome users out there. Users. I can't say users. Hey, what's up? This is Dan here with a quick tip for any Chrome users. Ugh. Chrome users. Chrome users. Some websites we might want to keep open for later, others we might be working with right now, and some we might just not. Oh, the download link is below. Let's go take a quick look at the one tab. At the one tab.